Hi Leo, it's Elle here to do a reading for you. Thank you for being here. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Leo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see what's going on for you Leo. How is Leo showing up to the reading? How is Leo? Okay, we've got the magician. So skilled, skilled labor. Uh, maybe you use uh, your words uh, for your work. Um, you could be a doctor, you could be um, someone who has gone on and got finishing in terms of their skill, uh, learned skill here. Some of you just taking matters into your own hands. It's like you're going to try to manifest whatever this is. What is this going on? Yeah, some of you trying to manifest the truth, some clarity. Yeah, Ace of Wands. Um, you want to know what someone is doing? Nine of Cups that's making them so happy. Um, maybe elsewhere with di different people. Someone wants to know what you're doing when you're away, when you are, um, you guys are not apart. Somebody just wants truth. They feel like if they get the truth, then things will be balanced out and they can move forward. Yeah, someone wants to know if somebody's sneaking off, lying, being deceptive. They just want the truth of the matter because it's becoming very toxic, very drama-filled. Seven of Wands. Um, they want to know who, who you're sleeping with, who you're with, who you're giving your love to. This could be what you want to know, Leo. Who is getting your person's attention? Or they want to know who's getting yours. Who, who are, who is your person giving time or energy effort to? Because they're not giving you everything. You feel like they're shutting you out. You feel like there's somebody that somebody's having sex with. When they travel, when they go away, there's something about a new group of people. Somebody feels like, okay, I'm not giving up on this relationship, but this is just a period of no forward movement. I feel like I've invested too much, therefore I'm not leaving. But I do need to think about what the future holds because there, this connection is real fragile. Like it can fall apart. How does Leo's person feel? How does the person that Leo is coming to the reading for, how do they feel? Okay, so they feel like two of pentacles, the relationship is up in the air, the fool card and the king of pentacles. So they feel like they can do whatever they want because they have money or they have, a, you know, prestige. They have a business, they have fame. I don't know. They feel like they, uh, they're the responsible party. Yeah, they could be saying this to you, knight of swords, that they're going to do whatever it is they want to do. King of wands. Yep. Prince of wands that they're going to, they'll be back. Oh, shit. Somebody said, I'll be back. Um, somebody's guides or guardian angels or in intuition is speaking to them someone is also saying look I'm committed to you you know we're in a commitment yeah we're in a commitment but um, somebody feels like somebody's too immature it's, it's not the healthiest relationship right now it doesn't mean that is never going to be healthy, but it's just not now. And maybe this is why somebody is, you know, dating around or keeping a lot of energy up. What is the advice for Leo? Somebody's also trying to run from their fears or their, their mental thoughts. Like something is taxing. Yeah. Remain positive. What goes on in the dark will come to the light. Explore. Yeah, ask questions. You know, because there is somebody holding a secret. It could be a Piscean person, Ace of Pentacles, Queen of uh, Pages. So it's like maybe this person is telling you, look, I'm committed to you. Maybe they go and they have their fun or they date or they flirt. Or they feel like they're committed to you. Yeah, but they feel like they're the boss in this relationship. 
if you stay here, the cards are saying that this person is committed to you, but it could, you know, you could suffer a bit of sadness. Things will eventually change. Eventually. It's like, not now, but it doesn't mean not ever. So that's what we have for you, Leo. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, uh, book your reading there. Ask uh, one question by booking the one question, one answer uh, on the website. And you can catch me live tonight, Monday, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, where you can come ask questions or just come for the collective reading. Thank you, guys. Many blessings.